Hello friends, welcome back to another video. I am at Ikea. If you've been following along with me, I just bought a new house. I'll leave uh, my house tour down below if you wanna see the space that I'm looking to decorate today. Um, I have a few things I need to purchase, like a, like a wall desk thing and um, like a glass cabinet. Uh, so those are like the two like big furniture things, but of course, who can go to Ikea and not buy all the knickknacks? So I'm super excited. Uh, yeah, so hope you enjoy some of the shopping footage and when I get back home, I will do a nice big haul and show you everything that I have picked up today. So I'm gonna get this sofa. Not this exact one, I'm gonna get it in gray and I'm gonna get it in an L shape, but I didn't want to order it until I came and sat on it, so I'm sitting on it and I like it, so I'm gonna get it. It's gonna be good. Mid-century mad all the way. So I wasn't planning on getting chairs because like the house came with like like bar stools for the like breakfast bar, but these are so amazingly mid-century mad that I'm going to get a couple of them. I probably won't show them in my haul because they won't be put together, um, but maybe, I don't know. So I'm picking up a couple of those. All right, I'm finally done at Ikea. And look at all of these cards of things. It got serious. Again, if you watch my other Ikea haul from like last year, I do this every time I'm at Ikea. My sanity just goes away and I just buy everything which is not like me. But, I mean, how often do you buy a new house? I have been waiting and waiting and waiting to buy things for it, so I really just let myself go today and buy every single thing that I wanted, so I'm super excited about all of it. Um, when I get home, I'll show you everything I got. But while I'm right here, uh, these veggie balls, they're like their meatballs. Um, they have chicken ones, they have their regular meatballs, and they have these veggie balls. I tried them in the like food uh, court here and they were really good so I bought a whole bag of them and maybe, just maybe, my children will eat them. I mean, probably not if we're being honest, but who knows, we'll give it a go. We like hiding. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine, we don't have to drive that far. It'll be okay. All right, you guys, I am back from Ikea. It is pretty late at night. Um, my sister lives like a half hour from our nearest Ikea, so uh, we always kind of make a big old day trip out of it. So sorry it's kind of dark in here, but I have so much stuff to show you. Before I show you anything, I will mention, oh yes, Duke, he missed me today. Um, there are a few things I'm not going to show you because there are things that need to be put together. One is a desk. The other are uh, those two like high tall chairs, also a glass display cabinet. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. So um, those are things I did buy, but if you stick around on my channel, you will note them probably in my house. So let's get started. You may notice I bought this big house plant and I've never had a house plant before. I'm not going to pick it up, but it, it's pretty big. It was only $14.99, I think. I also got like a, just a plain white pop for it. Uh, not super exciting, but I've never had a house plant. So leave me your tips down below. Do I know what type of plant it is? Nope, don't remember. Didn't even care to read anything about it, which I kind of regret now. But anyway, that's happened. So let's get right into it. The first thing I have, this is actually um, under the bed storage. Uh, they come in these long planks and then you like open them up and they're like big rectangles. So this I think was $8.99 and it is for under the bed because that is a place I like to store tons of stuff. So I got that. And in that collection, I also got other bins. Um, these are just like cube white bins. And these are a set, this is actually a set of seven little bins of all different types that are like drawer organizers. So they're all like squares and rectangles. And, all that stuff. If I opened everything, you would be here for like 45 minutes, so I'm not gonna go like that deep into it. Next, I've got some curtains. Um, I have massive windows in this house. They're huge. So I had to get a lot of curtains. These are just white curtains. Just nothing super fancy. I wanted to keep it light and airy in here, so I just wanted white. But because of all the windows we have, I got one, two, three, Four. So a total of eight panels just for one wall in this house. So you can look forward to some fabulous windows coming soon. 
Okay, the next thing I got is another piece of storage. I'm actually going to show you the little picture of it so you can see what it is. It actually like hangs in your closet and it has all these little compartments. So I thought now that I have a coat closet, which I'm very excited about, this would be perfect for hats and mittens and scarves and stuff like that. Next, I just got a pot with a lid because uh, we needed one, so not that exciting. I also got two packs of these sippy cups. They are so cute. They're like, I don't know, little dogs or whatever. Um, I think they're the perfect size, especially for like nighttime when I don't want my kids to have like a whole, you know, sippy cup full. These are like the perfect size, so I picked up a couple of those. I also got one of these uh, glass, like Tupperware style containers. I really like the glass ones. I think they like hold up really nice. They wash really easily. They don't get that like build up on them that like plastic does. Um, but I didn't have a large one, so I got this big boxy one and it was... It was around seven dollars I'm gonna say of course I will link all of the stuff down below on the Ikea website um, I'm not affiliated with them or anything like girl I paid full price for all this stuff um, but if you want to know the exact price or like more information about any of this stuff I will leave all the information down below next I got a pair of slippers I love these Ikea slippers which is ridiculous because they cost like two dollars I'm gonna put them on right now and they're really just like flimsy little slippers but like, I don't know about you, but I go through slippers like they get stinky and gross, you know? So like, I kind of like to just get new ones. Every time I go to Ikea, I just get a couple pairs of slippers. So that happened. So I actually got two packs of these. These are so cool. So for this summer, if you are a person who makes your own yogurt in your Instant Pot, like I do, um, or if you want to make smoothies or popsicles or whatever, these are so cool. They are these little silicone like reusable pouches that have these little lids so you could put like I don't know anything in there to take it on the go but we are definitely going to use it for like popsicles like I like to freeze yogurt and make like a popsicle out of it so I got two packs of these so that the boys will always have a healthy frozen snack this summer. Next I picked up a pack of this plastic silverware. We already have the bowls and the plates that match this from Ikea. Um, but uh, we have just like a bunch of mismatched like kid silverware and I thought let's just get one set get rid of the other stuff We always seem to be lacking forks for some reason. I don't know if that happens to you, but we needed that Next I got a print. I thought this print was so cool And you probably won't be able to find it because it was in the as-is section Which is stuff that they are getting rid of some of it's like defective or display items But most of it is just stuff they're like uh, not going to sell anymore so you probably won't be able to find this print but you will be able to find this beautiful frame that I got for it oh might help if I had it the right side so this is going to go somewhere in the new house um but it's got uh my colors this like uh jewel tone blue down here so very excited about these two things I also got us a new blanket I just got a king size bed and I'm very excited about it because like my husband and I have been sleeping on a full for a long time. So I needed some new blankets and like this one I thought was really good because it's like nice and thin. So it'll be a good like summery blanket and it was only $20 which is like a really crazy good deal for like one of these like weave like style blankets. So I got that. Next I picked up some glasses. These are so cute. They've got these um, like polka dots on them pink and blue I thought they were like lovely and retro perfect for my mid-century mod theme I'm trying to kind of go for in the house um, and I just really needed some new glasses you know I got kids they break all the time so I pretty much buy new glasses every time I go to Ikea next I got Ziploc bags well not Ziploc bags so I guess that's a brand but I always get a ton of them every time I go to Ikea because I just think they're really great they come in really great sizes they're fun colors like and they're a really good deal so if you've never tried Ikea Ziploc bags, give those a go because I love them. Next, I picked up these boxes of um, cookies and I thought they were so cute. They are just like tons of letters. And both my kids, especially my oldest Fox, are really into that right now, like letters. So I thought these would be great for their Easter baskets. So I picked up a couple boxes of cookies. Next, I got this lovely gold uh, candle holder. I'm starting to transition everything in my house into more like brass and gold uh, just to fit that more mid-century theme. So I tried to find some good gold accessories today and I thought this was good. I believe it was like $8-ish. 
And keeping with that theme, I also got these really great coasters that are this bright gold color. Uh, yeah, just throwing some gold in there. I also picked up one of these like wooden like people like that you can like maneuver and stuff. Um, I thought it would look really cute on my new desk which has like a bunch of shelves that you can like display things on. Um, I also think my children will really enjoy playing with this so uh, I just kind of couldn't say no. It looked like too cool for me to pass up. I also picked up, I actually got two of these. They're like these little night lights. Um, I'm just going to open one up. But they're these like little rubber raccoons. I thought they were so cute and they're just little night lights. Um, so I got each of the boys one of those for their rooms. Uh, I just, they were on sale for $5 and I had to get them. So that was a good find. I also picked up this little plant. Um, I was at Target the other day and I got a really good um, like pot in their dollar spot. But I needed a good plant to go in it and Ikea always has the best fake plants. I guess they have the best real plants too. Maybe not the best. I guess we'll find out depending on how long this stays alive. But uh, yeah, I'm like, I'm excited. But I'm also excited for the fake one because if this one dies, this one won't. Next, I got some prints that I thought were gloriously mid-century. And it came with four of these different prints. I really like that there's a lot of colors here because, um, um, it's really easy to find like a color palette for your house if you're working off a piece of art that's like pretty colorful. So like this blue color is like in my rug and like this yellow color is in another piece of art that I have and um, like the gray is in here. So it's really, these will do a really good job of tying in a lot of different colors that I got going on. And along with this I had to of course get some frames and Ikea seriously has the best like cheap frames. Like you can... You can look really amazing and like gallery like for really cheap at Ikea. So I got four of them. These are just a couple that are like in my bag. But I just got these like chunky white frames. I might paint them gold. I haven't decided. It depends on where they're going to go in the house. Next I picked up this um, like board. It's like a gold lattice and like the corners are like cute and it has little like clips on it. So basically it's like a memo board and I'm thinking I'm going to put it above my desk to put like I don't know, like pictures or notes or stuff like that. I just thought it looked really cool. So I hope it will be functional for me. It's like one of those things that like a, like a chalkboard or a corkboard that you think like, oh, I'm going to be so organized. And then you just like don't even use it. So we'll see if it actually functions for me. But I hope it does because I think it looks really cute. And again, it's bringing that gold in that I'm so into. And I think it was $15. Next, I got two of these. I already have one actually. These are number two and number three for my house and these are great for your boots and your shoes and all that stuff. I know it's about to be summer and it's like not as necessary but now that I have a beautiful coat closet, if you just want to hear about my coat closet one more time, I want to keep it nice. I want to put these in the bottom of the coat closet. So I think these were something like five dollars uh, but I definitely grabbed some of these because our other one has really worked well for us. So Next is one of my larger items. Again, I actually unwrapped it and put it together for you so I could show you. But they have the most amazing like storage side tables. There's one that's like white and this pattern too that's bigger. There's also like a blue one and one that like has little legs too. But I love the idea that I can have a table that also has stuff in it. I'm, I think I'm like really used to like having no storage at the old house. So I'm like, where can I put things? So like we can put maybe like our like throw blankets for like the couch in here or toys or stuffed animals or whatever. I haven't decided what I'm going to do with it yet but I just thought that this would be perfect and it has that little like you know modern you know vibe to it too so I think it will go really nice in here as well. And the last thing I'm going to show you is this gorgeous lamp here. I can lower it so you can see it a little bit better. I really needed a lamp for my desk area. The desk itself is pretty small. Like I promise if you keep watching my videos, you'll see it. It's like, it goes like all along the wall and whatever, but it needs a lamp really bad. And I didn't want to take up space on the desk by getting like a desk lamp. So I got this beauty that will go next to it. It's really, really heavy and I couldn't believe it. It was like $39. Like I'm not even kidding. I could not believe that I found a lamp that cheap. And I just thought it was really cool. And also, I got this light bulb uh, from Ikea too. It actually wasn't from this shopping trip. It was from my last one. Um, but it was something like 6 or $7. But it's one of those really cool Edison bulbs. Um, not super mid-century mod, but like, 
Um, you know, I don't want to keep it like all in that era. You know, I like to mix it like a little bit. So I thought that that would be like a more like current like touch. I mean, even though it's an Edison bulb, which makes it look really old, but like it's a new thing to decorate things old. I don't know. I'm going to stop now. But yeah, so I'm really, really excited about this lamp. All right, you guys, I'm going to say that this Ikea haul was a gigantic success. I spent way more money than I wanted to. I'm not normally a person that just like throws money everywhere. I usually am very conservative and I also like to really stick to a budget. But today I went wild and it is because I have waited so long to buy a house and just fill it with what I want, you know? And this is only a start and these are all things that are really functional that are gonna work really well for my family, especially the furniture pieces. I'm excited for you guys to see those in future videos, so stick around. And if you've never been to Ikea, get in your car and go, find one. I'm so sorry if you live like in a state that doesn't have one. I'm about like an hour and a half from one, so it takes a little time, a little planning to like make a trip out of it, but seriously, if you've never been to Ikea, go to Ikea. It will change you. Of course, hit that subscribe button and come back for more mom stuff, lady stuff, and life stuff. I post new videos every Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. It's been a little bit wild here because I uh, haven't gotten the internet yet in the new house, um, but it's coming very soon, and so my schedule's been a little bit wonky. But bear with me, and we'll be back on schedule as soon as possible. Uh, yeah, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Uh, bye. Thank you.